I'm Marilyn Hustis. I have recently retired from the National Institute on Drug Abuse after more than 25 years. In my clinical research laboratory, we chose a QX Active and a QX Active Plus. It's very important for laboratories to be able to look at their whole spectrum of what they want to offer and decide what are the reasons and purposes of doing this testing. What is the proper matrix? What can I gain from it? I'm Michael Fugeser from the University of Munich, Germany. My research work is focused on therapeutic drug monitoring and the quantification of small molecules. There is simply no alternative to mass spectrometry as a very reliable, versatile and user-friendly technology. Orbitraps in general, they allow us to see the whole range of metabolites and we can do retrospective analysis. So if we find something interesting, we can always go back to the data. We don't have to run another sample to check something. When I first started, you know, there'd be 15 techs in the department. It would take me eight hours to do a few isoenzyme samples by gel electrophoresis and now there's one person pushing a button. Orbitrap technology is the only technology that allows for targeted, untargeted, and unknown screening, as well as quantitation or confirmation using the same instrument. Not to mention the opportunity for efficient polarity switching, which allows for detection of both positively and negatively ionizing compounds in the same run. The high-res mass spec looks at many different aspects, the molecular weight, isotope variability, then can do beautiful library matching, and obviously the retention time that comes from the chromatography separation of those compounds. We can also build larger panels with more drugs in a shorter period of time without sacrificing the accuracy and the quality of the results. The novel psychoactive substances has probably been the greatest challenge to toxicology laboratories in decades. A mass spec can rapidly design applications for new drugs, whereas immunoassays are going to take 18 months to come to commercial use. So mass spectrometry is actually giving us the tool to address this epidemic with the novel psychoactive substances. Mass spectrometry is without question superior to immunoassay technology because it allows the specific quantification of small molecules, which is not possible with immunoassay technology. The quality of the data is so much better, and it gives you more information in a smaller period of time. It is a tool to help you provide better health care for people.